Hello everyone, it's Maria with Angelfish Design and today I have for you my July design team project for Dear Julie Julie. It is this super fun stacked envelopes. Super pretty. And the three digital kits that I use to create this are Colorful Daisy, More Antique Daisy, and the Assorted Ephemera Bases. So this is a super fun project with all of these pretty stacked up envelopes. And this can be sent as a fun happy mail, or it could be displayed in your craft room to hold your ephemera. And I think that's what I may do with this. I'm gonna put it on a little book stand or plate stand so that I can just have that on display on this particular corner here. I have these little beads, cute little dangle. But there's all kinds of fun stuff in here on all the different envelopes. We have this little crocheted daisy there. It's held together with a bit of my shabby fabric ties. This is uh, coffee dyed seam binding and some lace seam binding stitched together. And then there's lots of images from the digitals as well as some extra um, scrapbook paper. Ugh, words again are failing me. All right, so let's untie this and see how this works. All right, again, that's that super pretty fun fabric style treatment there to make a tie. All right, so each of these envelopes is a different size and they are attached at each uh, flap on the envelope. So again, we have that really pretty daisy right on top and this is the smallest of the envelopes. And inside is some of the digital from the colorful daisies kits, super pretty. And little embellishment there and it says whisper to my heart inside this pocket is a little embellished flinch card I'll put that back in later and then this flips up to the next envelope which has some of the pretty daisy images and this one hangs over the edge a little bit hanging over the edge there too some nice fibers and lace underneath there Inside this one, we have a couple of different things. I have this pretty little bit of ephemera. This is a wonderful creature. And I fussy cut the bird from one of the images. And then there's a little library card. This is just some lightweight paper that I printed that on. Great for journaling. And then some of the postcard digital. And I just turned that into a little card. And we flip this one open. Now, if you want to make one of these for yourselves, just make sure that whenever you are gluing anything down, whether it is the envelope on top of the next one or any of your imagery, do not put it past the top of the envelope that's underneath. Because otherwise, if this sticks out here, you're not going to be able to open that very easily. It'll get in the way. So always make sure there is nothing past those lines. Okay, so we have our next envelope here. We have. I again fussy cut one of the images and then added a little bit of some Tim Holtz distress stickles. I'm not sure if they still make those or not, but of course I have lots of old stuff in my stash. So I use that. And then in here we have the library card pocket. It says your charming smile. And a little packet of tags that I made out of the wallet size printable of the colorful daisy. And then I just punched the tops of those and tied them together with a little bow. And another from the um, assorted ephemera bases, this really cool vintage check image, and just the library pocket there. And in the next one, I made a fun shaker inside of that flap on this envelope. And here, this has again some more fussy cut images, and I layered up uh, some of the scrapbook paper scraps and part of one of the bases and it says there is no real substitute and all of these that I've used were from some old Tim Holtz I don't even know what they call them they're the little sentiments or whatever sheets of stickers that he has with that okay and then for this one this is a fun little pocket you can put that in a journal if you wanted with the postcard there and this is a cute little book so it has the postcard images on the front and back and then lined paper inside so you could write for some extra journaling and then this has the pretty little girl with her daisies and her cute little hat on that one and that flips over 
And this one inside is again from the bases kit. It always looks so awesome. And then this is a bit of some tea stained index card. And again, some more of those stickles layered up with some lace. And then I just cut this out of um, one of the pieces of ephemera. And then there's another fussy cut piece with the bird and the daisies there and some more of those blue stickles. And a nice large tag in there. And this bit of ephemera. You could actually put that right on there and have a nice decorated tag if you like. And this one says, listen to the laughter. All right, this next one folds up like this. Oops, running out of space here. All right, so then we have this envelope is made out of some daisy scrap of paper, as is the one underneath it. But it have a fussy cut daisy there, and it says the most beautiful thing. And then the inside of the flap is, again, from one of the... Um, now, this one is, is from the Daisy kit, and I've just gone and highlighted the words that say Daisy on there. And inside is a pretty card. You can use that for journaling or send it to someone as a card, a little thinking of you, what have you. And then inside this large pocket envelope is one of the large pictures of the daisies, the colorful daisies, super pretty. And again, I fussy cut one of the daisy images, and this says one today is worth two tomorrows. Got lots of layers, fibers, and lace, and I've repurposed, I don't think it's in this one, but on these, I've repurposed uh, a bag from some lemons. So that makes a fun background as well. Okay, and then inside this one, we have another large tag, some pretty eyelet lace, and a little bit of journaling space there for you, and a nice cluster here. And you could also journal on the back of that as well. And then another little booklet. Super fun. All right, well, I hope you have enjoyed this share, project share for my July design team project. And I will see you back next time. Take good care. Bye bye.